We work for construction workers and their families. We understand that men don't always like to ask for help and support and so we know that there are probably more mental health issues than are actually admitted to. In Queensland we lose on average 43 workers each year to suicide in our industry. You know, I suppose the stress and the stress of whether you're getting paid or whether you're going to lose everything or lose your house, you know, it's just um yeah, it can be devastating for the family life. It's, I suppose it's completely unacceptable in 2016 for our members to do a job and not get paid for the work they do. Simply not being paid is not a problem if you've got plenty of money. But if you don't get paid and you don't have a lot of money, then obviously that becomes a major stressor. It's just the stress that, you know, it's just the everyday life just gets consumed by it. It's not only the person who's thinking about suicide who's struggling, it's also the family, the wife and the children around that person that is affected by that. So it's like a ripple effect where we just have uh, poor mental health in our industries just have a massive impact right across the state. I've talked to people that have depression, they have um, substance abuse problems, alcohol problems. It's just another bloke who's doing it tough and uh, we just need to deal with the issues whether they are private issues or work issues because they're all interlinked. A bloke at home, he was a former scaffolder that lost the money on the same job I lost the money on and he ended up living in his car. One person, a concreting subcontractor, that had absolutely lost everything. He'd lost home, he'd lost everything he'd worked for, I think, for 15 years. It's really important just to ask, are you okay, because I have noticed this or that. Um, it tells that person that I have actually seen you and that I care. And that means whether it's about suicide or whether it's just about struggling with making the next mortgage payment, it actually invites people to talk about what's going on for them.